these are the instructions for plate five, which is the isometric cube. With isometrics, we're going to be drawing them at 90 degrees and 30 degrees. You need your regular equipment, your scale, and your 30, 60, 90 triangle. To start this, in the drawing section up at the top here, what you're going to do is you're going to measure halfway across, and since this is 10 inches wide, I'll put a mark at 5. And I'm going to draw a construction line through the middle of this section, right here. From the top of the horizontal border line on the top of the title block, measure up 5 eighths of an inch and put your initial point. It's going to be 5 eighths of an inch. If you don't measure this carefully and you put it too high, the top of the drawing will be off it. If you put it too low, it'll be hit down here. <coughs> After you draw your, make your initial point, what you draw, set your 30 degree triangle up, you're going to draw a 30 degree construction line in this direction, and you're going to draw a 30 degree line in this direction. It's pretty important on these to make sure that they cross exactly at the same point. Otherwise, as you transfer the dimensions, they'll be wrong when you get to the top. From your initial point, measure up two and a half inches and put your second point. From there, align your 30 degree triangle. You're going to draw a 30 degree construction line this way, and you're going to draw another 30 degree construction line in the opposite direction. Where these 30s cross, for example, right here and right here, we're going to draw a 90 degree construction line on each one of these points. Where the top 30 and the 90s cross, here and here, I'm going to take the 30 and we're going to draw a 30 degree line this way and a 30 degree line this way. Now have the outline of the cube and it's simply a matter of darkening in the proper lines, which should not be too difficult. I like to do all of my lines at the same angle at the same time to avoid shifting my instruments around. Okay, we're back to a little drawing here. Come back. There, I have the outline of my cube. Next, we're going to draw the windows. On this side, I'm going to put a mark at half an inch. And one and a half. On this side, I'm going to put a mark at one and one. Draw a construction line here and here through those lines. Now I'm going to measure up. I'm going to start over on this edge. I'm going to come up half an inch and I'm going to come up another inch above that. And on this, we're going to use an inch and an inch on this side. I simply use my 30 degree triangle. I'm using constru I'm I'm using construction lines now. I now have the outline of the windows and I can come back in here.
isometrics are drawn at 30 and 90 degrees, you'll not be using any zero degree or horizontal lines. The middle of these, pretty simple. You're going to put a mark halfway through. Since it's an inch, I'll just put a mark at half an inch here and here and here and here. And I can use my my 90. I'm going to divide this. Basically, I'm dividing it into quarters, but I'm doing it at 30 and 90 degrees rather than at zero. And once I have these marks in here, it's pretty simple to come back and just add the proper lines to, to this. Just pay attention to which way you're drawing it, and you should be fine. And then for the corner, go to the corner here and just draw 30 off the corner. And there you have the isometric cube. If you take your time, you get your measurements right, concentrate on it, all of your angles will add up so that they all meet at the top.